It sheared bark off of trees, destroyed homes, ripped families apart. The devastation, unfortunately, is something our state knows all too well. Yeah, we have live team coverage of the tornado aftermath, and we begin with News 9's Augusta McDonald live in Mayfield, Kentucky. Augusta. Yes, there's debris everywhere. Um, everywhere you look here, strewn across the ground, it's hard to even find a single object that hasn't been broken or smashed. And all of this really tells the story of what happened in Mayfield Friday night. I spoke with one woman today, Charlene Clark. This is her home. She's cleaning it up. It's completely destroyed. And she wanted to show me this box with an Illinois delivery address. It came in through her window during the tornado. The outbreak of tornadoes on Friday night is now reported to have caused damage in six or seven states. We're hearing other stories just like Charlene's. People finding others belonging states away. Neighbors and friends are now helping with the extensive cleanup that's needed to clear miles of debris in Mayfield and across Kentucky. Charlene was telling me today that she's so grateful her life was saved. She walked inside this morning and just cried. She wasn't there at the time, but feels she was saved by God's grace. Charlene told me that her son and his family lived just around the corner from where she was at, and someone had to come in and kick down a wall to get them out of the closet um, where they were hiding from the tornado. Her whole family survived. Her daughter is also in this area. Um, we have more stories from Mayfield coming up at 6 p.m. Live in Mayfield, Augusta McDonald, Oklahoma's own News 9.